Love it. What's up, guys? Today's blog is about the things you need to do before you go back to the Philippines. So without further ado, let's do this. The first thing you need to have before you go back to the Philippines is the QR code coming from the Philippine Red Cross. Without this, you cannot take the swab test. You can also do this in the Philippines, but it will take a lot of time because our internet is as slow as your grandma. So it will take a lot of time for you to get your QR code coming from your email. Now, ngayon, kung hindi nyo pa rin maibigay yung QR code, they will just quarantine your ass for three years. <laughs> Pero we pay the money more. Airline personnel will ask you to fill up a health form before you land. So you gotta make sure you meron kayong sariling ball pen. Kasi bawal manghiram at bawal magpahiram. Violation yan sa health conduct and baka hindi kayo mabigyan ng lunch. Now you know you're in the right place pag land nyo because people will look at you like you did something wrong. Social distancing friends. Social distancing mga friends. Yep. Now alam nyo rin kung nasa right room kayo because a bunch of soldier will ask you kung OFW ba kayo. And pag sinagot mo na yes, then they will ask you another question kung land base and sea base. Now, I was confused and happy at the same time kasi binigyan na naman nila ako ng another form. That's why dapat meron talaga kayong sariling ball pen. Now, ngayon, kung may QR code kayo, good for you because you can go straight to the sticker man sticker man will give you three stickers and you can take the swab test yep enjoy the swab test they have a 12 inch stick it will go straight down to your nostrils yes enjoy the show now after this the swab test you need to go to the immigration feeling messed up kasi pasok na pasok ang 12 sticks sa ilong nyo yep after that you will have to proceed to the luggage you gotta pick up your luggage pero make sure luggage nyo ang makukuha nyo or else another violation yan yep you're looking for another three years in quarantine yep with no pay that's right guys so after that you need to go to another line to confirm whether you are an OFW or tourist yep para yan sa inyong accommodation so right here you will have to fall into this line and as you can see guys everybody wants to be an OFW kasi libre ang hotel accommodation that's right pero hindi rin kayo makakalusot kasi meron silang computer yeah and so maraming natagalan kasi everybody wants to be an OFW that's right. Once you are confirmed, they will ask you kung ano yung pwede at hindi nyo pwedeng kainin so they know what to give you in the hotel. And then you will have to get a box, a lunch box and a bottle of water. That is right. And so you have to be happy at this point. Now, after that, you will have to go out and take your bus straight to the hotel. At this point, I was crossing my fingers because I really don't know where they're going to take us. That's right, guys. It's very confusing. At the same time, you're happy and exhausted. Yep. And then, a mother parent will come up. Pagdating sa hotel, this guy is so cool because he is also tired and confused. So he just say, Kapish guys, let's go. Yep, everybody's excited, happy, confused at the same time. Yes, once you get to your presidential suite, yep, you will be happy as hell. Look at me, I'm happy and confused at the same time. 
yep all you want to do is take a shower get some warm drink yes maybe get some snack and head to bed that is right guys i am so messed up at this time i don't know what i'm saying I just want to take a shower and sleep. Alright guys, I hope may natutunan kayo dito sa blog. I will, if you need the QR code, I will leave it in my description box. So all you gotta do is click it. Alright guys, see you next time. Capiche?